Is it Christmas already? Hello guys, who are you? David DeFranco here from davidthefranco.com. This right here is my arcade block unboxing for March 2016. Huge emphasis on the March because it is indeed April 5th, the day I'm uploading this. Don't tell anyone, but today is actually April 4th. j Puff's birthday. If you want to wish j Puff a happy birthday, do so right below, he'll love it. But anyway, I just thought I would make that clear. So don't think I'm going crazy. I know it's April and not March. But for whatever reason, Arcade Block always arrives a few days into the next month. I'm not sure why. I mean, I don't really mind, it's not a big deal. It's just kind of odd. It's just kind of odd. Anyway, Arcade Block, for those not aware, is basically a monthly Christmas for gamers, geeks, nerds, like you and myself. I mean, come on, who doesn't like this kind of stuff? Especially considering I just went to South Jersey Geek Fest just a few days ago. Check that video out. This is like a really rare moment for me. This is exciting. Have you ever done autographs before? I don't think no. so. Really? I have. No. It's awesome. No. Sorry. Sorry. That's an awesome idea. What? Cosplay kickball? No. What a cool idea. You get a picture with you? Hey, what's going? Oh, what's going on? Yeah, oh, you write like a four-year-old, dude. Well, I can't write with a marker. <laughs> it looks. Let me see that. Okay, like let, show me that. Yeah, it's good. That's a forgery. That looks like. It looks like Penelope wrote it. Now the full video for those interested is linked right below. Okay, let's see here. Every month you do get a shirt. Unfortunately, I'm not a Deadpool fan yet. I have yet to see the movie. I've heard it's incredible, and who knows? Maybe I will turn into a Deadpool fan. But this month's shirt is indeed a Deadpool shirt. Actually, it looks like it's roughly based on the classic Donkey Kong, which is, by the way, back when Mario was called Jumpman. A little trivia for you. Maybe this is related, maybe it's not. I don't know. But I'm just gonna pretend it is because obviously I know all about Donkey Kong. DK, Donkey Kong. But cool, I like it, Deadpool. Actually, I'll probably give this to my friend Josh. So Josh, if you're watching, here comes yet another a uh, little geeky item for you to enjoy, because I know he loves Deadpool. Mega Man figure, okay. From Monster Factory. Let's open Mega Man. Gotta say that the plushie looks kind of weird. I don't know. <laughs> I mean, obviously the armor, like his suit and whatever, it looks like Mega Man, but his face, I don't know, is it just me? His face looks kind of like a South Park character. Is that a good thing or a bad thing? I don't know, that's completely up to you. I just think it's funny. Okay, now this I can relate to. Resident Evil Nemesis. Oh my God, yes. It's an arcade block exclusive. Arcade block, well done. Wow. I don't think I have any Resident Evil figures on my shelves back there, you know, the, the yeah, cubes I mean. So this is really cool and it can actually inspire me to buy other Resident Evil figures. Maybe a Jill Valentine. I've always had a thing for Jill. I just like her a lot. But cool, there is the nemesis with the big ass bazooka. I believe we first met the nemesis in Resident Evil 3 Nemesis. And it actually makes an appearance in the movies too, or at least one of the movies. And it just happens to be Resident Evil's 20th anniversary, as it says on the base. Very cool, this is quite nice. And definitely my favorite item yet for March. All right, this is another arcade block exclusive, nesting dolls. Don't know who that is. It's probably a Pokemon, not really sure. Oh, wow. Well, isn't this magical? <laughs> Just <kidding. laughs> I don't know who these characters are, but I'm definitely amused. <laughs> oh my God, that's funny. Is that it now? No, there's more. Yes, this is definitely Pokemon. That's a Pokeball on the bottom. Is that it? Okay, that's it. Hey look, you can put your weed in there. It's from a movie. I don't smoke marijuana. I'm getting emails. And finally, a Just Cause 3 Arcade Block exclusive. Wow, okay. This is really impressive, Arcade Block. If my counting is correct, there are three Arcade Block exclusive items this month. So guys, if you want to sign up for Arcade Block, please do so using that link right below, arcadeblock.thefran.co. That is my promotional link, so if you use that link, not only do you help me out, 
but it basically tells them, hey, Arcade Block, I signed up through David DeFranco, and he's pretty awesome. Nah, he's all right. But seriously, this is another exclusive item, Just Cause 3, which I have yet to play, but I will eventually. I never got around to buying Just Cause 2, but I do own Just Cause 1. Beautiful game, beautiful, beautiful game. It's as if it's a business card, but it's not. So this is, where's my knife? I hate the sound of foam. Oh, oh. It's like murder to my ears. Oh, God. All right. Oh, it's the grappling hook. Wow, with no body attached. That is really neat. Very, very nice. So if you're a fan of Just Cause, you will definitely appreciate this. Again, I played the first one, so I can actually relate to this. I just never got around to playing the second one. I probably never will. Um, but the third one, I'll probably get around to buying that eventually. Maybe when it's like $30. It's not exactly a priority. I still don't own The Division, The Witcher 3, and there's some other games I still have to buy. But cool, this is definitely very nice. And as usual, you get a couple documentation cards. This April, Arcade Block is bringing you a next level item from Borderlands, along with some legendary items from Zelda and Assassin's Creed. So if you're a fan of any of these franchises, come on, make it happen, guys. Again, Arcade Block, right below. Sign up, make it happen, do it, do it, treat yourself. And this card just details everything that was included in March's box. All right, there you go. In my opinion, a huge success, but my favorite item by far has to be Nemesis. This is very, very cool. All right, guys, thank you so much for watching, and huge thanks to Arcade Block for making this video possible. I appreciate it. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.